guys so today we're going to try something here um i want to start a new survival world i'm going to put it on peaceful so i can work mobs so the whole thing of the uh you got to get diamonds right that's the biggest thing that i've learned so far in my experimenting with minecraft is really can't play play until you got diamonds so I'm still pretty new. I still don't know any tricks or anything. So what I'm going to do here is see how quickly I can get diamonds starting out in a brand new survival world. Now again, I put it on peaceful. That way it will, um, I don't have to worry about mobs attacking me, but I still got to watch out for lava and drowning and stuff like that. And so here we are. I'm going to go ahead. Hey, look, we spawned next to a village. So this might make it quicker. So I'm going to start the stopwatch now. All right, so I got my stopwatch going. So first thing, let's go check out this village, see if there's any resources I can use, and I don't have to worry about making. Moo moo cow. And so I've started and stopped several different worlds. Um, I have my main world that I, that I have in creative that I've been building, and that's the one I'm thinking about turning into a realm once I get some real internet here and quit using my mobile data. Um, and I did take y'all's advice and I copied it. Oh, there's an iron golem dude. So this must have a lot of villagers in it. Hey, they did double doors like I do. Uh, take an apple. Yep, I'm stealing from these poor unsuspecting villagers. Sorry man, I don't have anything to trade you. Yeah, I have nothing. Move, Gerald. Huh. I don't need no stinking maps. I don't even know about maps. Don't know how to make them, don't know how to use them. What is this guy doing? Dude, come out of the closet. It's 2021. But in your own time, whatever you're comfortable with, no judgment. I don't know if y'all notice, I get lost real easy in Minecraft. I'm not finding good stuff, y'all. All right, so about to give up and go make stuff. So the iron golem doesn't make iron. He's literally a golem made out of iron. He just protects the village. Is that correct? Hey, look right there. All right, so I need some wood. Well, somebody killed something. Y'all hear, I don't know if y'all can hear Jeff talking in the other room. So, we got a whole bunch of wood here. That way I can make me a crafting table. And also make me a bunch of sticks. Make me an axe, pickaxe, shovel. Yeah, I'm not as fast as you guys on this. Of course, we've already been going for nearly five minutes. I spent four minutes wandering around the village in there. 
and I probably miss stuff. I'm not, like I said, I still don't really know my way around. But I'm learning. I like the just building stuff part. That's fine. Would that be a fun realm, a fun server? Or would we just build a city? There used to be this game. And it may still be a game if people play, I don't know. Like 15 years ago called Sims. And that was really all you did was just build stuff. People, is that still a game? People still play that? Let me know in the comments. Yes or no, Sims is still a game. I bet it's evolved and it's like a whole different level now. Dang gum. My knuckles are getting sore. I always knew I could chop down trees in my bare hands. I don't know how many I need. I've probably got enough, but I'm not taking chances. Let's see here. Knock away, knock away. So I'm going to build me a crafting table. Which I know there's one in that village. I just don't spend the time to find it. Because this is not explore the village. This is dig down and get diamonds as quick as possible. Alright. I want to find a good area to dig too. See, I'm going to cheat ish and use this area because, well, we've got copper over there. We've already got some coal here, and there's some iron right there. So let's make a crafting table. Well, let's make some wood planks first. All right, we got a bunch of wood planks. Crafting table made. We need sticks. Oops, I'm clicking the wrong button. Wait a minute. I don't want to make an oak button. What else do we need to make? Alright, so... Let's get some stone. Oh, it's going to take forever. Wait a minute. It didn't give me any. Well, how do I make a wood pickaxe? Oh, I'm an idiot. I got to put my crafting table out. Here we go. Go ahead and make one of those. Let's make two just to back us up. Come here. So my other world, I was exploring a mine shaft, and I found a uh, golden apple. That's a cool thing, right? Don't they do cool stuff? All right, let's 
Let's make a couple of those. Let's get these out of my way here. And put that right there because I'll just go over here. Man, I can't resist good. I can't resist resources when I see them. Like even though copper is only good for making like lightning rods and stuff like that, I want to go mine that copper we saw over there. That's not a bad score on this. Right here off the bat. All right. Yep, this is taking way longer than I thought it would. But we're going to figure it out. Come on, give me my iron bars. Oh, I need three. How many stone pickaxes do I have? Just the one? Yeah, you know what? Let's make a couple more. I can hear the villagers in the background. Oh, Gerald's loud. Oh, there's an iron golem up there. He better stay away. I'm going to beat him with a pickaxe. Stone. Oh, I can make an iron one. That's all we can do there. What? Wait a minute. Oh, I know. Sorry, guys. I'm being dumb. See, I'm still learning. I'm trying to make torches in the uh, furnace. All right. Well. Let's go dig. So it's 1421. I can't believe y'all are still watching. Um, I don't have coordinates turned on. Hang on. All right, so we're at 62. The consensus is that 
the best chance of getting them starts at 11. So I'm going to leave a uh, torch here to mark her away. Man, look at that. We run into water. Leave a torch right there. You know what? Let's start digging this way. This may be wrong, but we're going to do it. All right. It's dark. I like going too wide. Hey, we'll need that. That's what I mean about not being able to turn down resources. But it's iron. We're going to need it eventually. Put some oh alright so y'all gonna think this is silly but I don't want to get lost so blocking my way Oops, I didn't mean to be on it. And yeah, there's probably faster, more efficient ways to do this. Well, I know there is because I've seen two videos of it. But this is what we got going. And look at me. Man, I will screw up everything every time. You know what? I forget that if I crouch and let me stand on the edge. Alright, so here we are. We're at 11. So we're going to plant a torch right here. Now, is 11 where I'm standing or is 11 where I'm looking? I don't know. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go this way. Torch behind us. And we're just going to dig straight in. And we broke a first stone pickaxe. I'm just going to go till it's too dark. nothing all right new method we're gonna go to the wall and we're just gonna hammer as far as we can go without moving I'm 
nothing. So I'm just going to clear out this area all through here and see if we have any. So we'll start right here. Guys, this is not looking. Am I just being impatient? I'm not seeing any diamonds. Some of my red stuff. It lights up pretty. Yeah, so just uh, nothing. Do the same thing this way. Hey, I wonder. Can I? No, I was trying to see if I could squat and get inside the hole and crawl. It doesn't work that way. What I'm going to do is I'm going to clear this area out, and if there's nothing here, I'm going to take it down one more block. And that's stone pickaxe number two broken. Yeah, so, uh, oops, tell me what y'all think. I also heard a rumor that they changed it to level five. If I clear this out one more level and we have nothing, then we'll go down to level five. see anything so I'm gonna take everything I've cleared out I've opened up so far and we're gonna take it down one more level so either I just picked a spot with no diamonds at all or there's none at level 11, 10, 11, or 12. Yeah, let's change that to an iron pickaxe. Okay, I lied. I went down one level deeper. I just wanted the pretty red rocks, dadgummit. Plus, it'll make this easier. I 
I mean, it's not looking good for the home team, guys. Yeah, this goes much quicker with a iron pickaxe. Okay, I think the consensus is we're going to and I'm sticking this right here just so I can remember where our tunnel up is. Alright. Let's go down to level 5. So I believe that's bedrock, guys. switch to iron just because it does it a lot quicker Alright guys, there is no, there is, there are no diamonds here. Where's the light coming from? Huh. We're at the bottom of the world here. So. All right. So all I'm going to do is to hammer out more of this. We only got two more minutes. I'm not. I'm not going to do this in more than thirty minutes. If we can't find it in thirty minutes, then this is a fail on my part. as far as I can in one line in this last minute. That's it. That's it. <laughs> Jeff just walked through he didn't realize I was recording. Stupid gravel. Goodness. We got fifteen seconds. Alright guys, that's 30 minutes. 30 minutes, um, 25 of it spent um, 
20 of it anyway, spent digging around and found no diamonds. So I guess we'll have to find another place in the world to dig. Anyway, appreciate y'all guys watching. Uh, I know this was probably a little boring, but this is what happens. You get a new guy trying to find diamonds quickly. Uh, thanks for liking and subscribing. Love all y'all. God bless y'all. Roll Tide.